very much, Jennifer Ann 502. We want to continue with some breaking news. A wild police chase started in Warren. It came to a crashing end in Detroit. Yeah, it spanned several freeways with the driver trying to shake police the whole time. 7 Action News reporter Brian Abel joins us now to explain why the chase started and who was inside the car, Brian. Yeah, police say the chase started somewhere in Warren near 13 and Ryan somewhere in that vicinity, but it ended right here. You can see the highway entrance ramp is right here behind me and Connor that overpass. That is where this police chase ended when the vehicle crashed. And now we did get here on scene as police were still here, still trying to piece together and investigate what happened right here as that vehicle crashed. And at some point, we are told shots were fired. Now, early reports suggest one of the suspects, they tried to either run over or charge an officer, and that's when police opened fire. And you can see bullet holes in the stolen Jeep here in this video. And at least one suspect was hit, but the injuries are minor, we're told. And firefighters, they had to work to get a second suspect out of the car due to damage from the crash. Now, we are told that this chase ended up going on and off the freeway, and of course, police still investigating all that led up to this. We were told that a B and E uh, SWAT or B and E um, unit was investigating. And that's what initiated this chase in the first place over in Warren. For now, reporting live in Detroit, Brian Abel, Seven Action News. Yeah, thanks, Brian. We have